Drone strike in the northern Nigerian state of Kaduna has killed at least 85 people. Many of the victims were worshippers who'd gathered in the area to mark a religious holiday. The state security spokesman called it an accident, which happened during an army operation. The military has increased its offensives in the area after several security breaches at Kaduna Airport. Fidel Simba is following developments from northwest Kaduna State in Nigeria. This is Tudundiri village, where hundreds of Muslim faithfuls under this tree on Sunday night were marking the Malud celebrations in honor of the birth of Prophet Muhammad. While they were at the event, suddenly they started witnessing attacks from different directions. They weren't sure where the gunshots were coming from, but at the last count, about 85 of them have been killed and they've been buried in two mass graves just behind uh, where we're standing. And government has ordered investigations to ascertain what actually happened. The military has owned up saying that it was an error on the part of its personnel who were deployed to carry out uh, military operations in the area because this area is known for coming under at repeated attacks from armed groups. And the government is saying that no stone will be left unturned in trying to ascertain how, you know, what happened and to also prevent future occurrence because dozens of them are still in the hospital fighting for their lives and the villagers are hoping that there will be no more casualties, especially from those who are in the hospital. A similar incident happened in north central uh, Nasarawa state where headers were targeted by military aircraft until date there has not been any publicly announced punishment for those who were behind it. The villagers we spoke to are hoping that the government will be able to compensate them this time around so that at least they can have some form of closure after the incident. Fidelis Mba, Al Jazeera, Tudundiri, Northwest Nigeria.